Ah, oh, good, I'm back. <laughs> Welcome back. I made it to the depths. That was so legit. How long did that take me? A very long time. Literally, I've just beat the Capra Demon and I've gotten to the depths. And that took you all that time. Jesus. <laughs> I'm still kind of just like... Uh, I can't believe... I got so lucky. When he was spamming like the um, force thing to knock me off at the top, I got so lucky in that part. Yep. Oh, there's the butcher guy. I should fuck him up. Come on, butcher. Let's do this fucking thing. Wow, he took three hits. This fucking sword is so good. And in the chest we have Large Ember. The secret ahead. No, that's the fool that leads to that guy, which I actually don't want to do. <laughs> Even the one that I jumped down. Yeah, I don't want to do that myself. I want to go get the rusted iron ring and do all that shit. Well, you need to go. To, you need to go back to Firelink then. Yeah. I'm about to homeward bone out there in a sec. Just making some last kills. Whew. Wading like an asshole through this fucking water Let's to kill some dogs. Two bars of battery. Eh. Cool. Eh. Eh. All right, guys, going back in. Let's go back into that. I cannot believe I. Yeah, you gonna go fight her now? Not right this second. You gonna home with bone out and then go back to her in a bit? Yeah, I got some stuff to do first. See, I'm outside the. You do have a lot of souls. It'll be a shame to lose them. Home with bone out. I'm just home with burned out as well. Let's get some more I'm so I'm so gonna cut that bit out of the live stream and just fucking upload that as a video. Do it. It is time to wade through these guys like so much meat. Whew. By the way, so I got the Aeto now. I wanna show you that. Yeah. Aieto. So this is the Uchi Katana. This is the Aieto. Looks basically the same. Very similar attacks. That's Style wise, yeah. See, exactly the same. Those attacks are exactly the same. So it's just the Aieto. It's a way big stat bonus compared. No, that that's the thing. Its strong attack is that. He puts it into the scabbard, then draws it in as a Instead of that fucking long wait. Yeah. Also, the, does the, the Aieto has different stats, I think. Still be, be scaling. Ha, the Uchi Katana actually has a better scaling. Because they're both B, but the B, if I go on the Uchi Katana, the B is blue, which means it's better. Because B, B, uh, when, when sca scalings aren't solid numbers, they're, they're ranges. So, like, just because two weapons have A scaling doesn't mean they have the same scaling. It means they're in the same board, they're in the same band of scaling. So the Aether... Alright, so then blue... Uh, blue B is the high B. Yeah, blue B means that it's this like has B slightly better... Yeah, the blue blue B means that this weapon uh, also has B scaling, but it's slightly better.
Well, the, bl the blue is because I'm comparing it to a weapon or I'm currently equipped. Like, blue just shows... Bl uh, any stats that are highlighted in blue means they're better than what you have equipped. In fact, I'm just going to look it up now. I'm going to go on the wiki and look it up because I'm not entirely sure. Oh, I missed an eye out of it. I, I actually forgot to open up the fire link shortcut. <laughs> Whoopsie. I have two of the four katanas in the game currently. Nice. Soon you have enough to put on the wall for a bitchin sword collection. So if you just take a Uchi katana to plus 15, it goes to base 225 damage and A scaling in. Okay. And Aieto goes to. this. Yeah, the Aieto goes to. To 20 with a scaling, so they're pretty much they're almost identical. It's just the other one has a better heavy. It's, just, it's the different move, so yeah. Interesting. Cool. I'm gonna I'm gonna go and upgrade the Ayato and um, use that. I think. Oh, it's that sorcerer guy. Totally not gonna learn your magic. Go away. I'm not talking to you. Imminent rear. <laughs> oh, looks like Rhea's companions have arrived. Man, I want to kill this fucking guy who's, talk who's just talking smack at me. I forget what his name is. You know the one on the Firelink Shrine he's just staring at you like, Oh, you made it! <laughs> oh, you mean, um, Crestfallen Warrior? The dude who's like, the you're first the guy you see basically when you don't start the game. Yeah. Oh, your face, you're practically hollow! What happens if I kill him? Nothing. You, you do mean the guy in like got in like blue chain mail armor, right? Yeah, yeah. He's just got there with the sword, and he hears that voice like, "Ah, oh, hello there." Not absolutely nothing oh, happens. You. Nothing happens, so I can just fucking kill him. Well, okay. One thing because you, because you killed an NPC, you'll get um. There's like an internal value that like called sin. Killing NPC gives you sin, which means the higher your sin, the more likely you are to be invaded by a uh, dark moon, which is a type of PvP. -er. That's the only thing it'll do. Fuck it, then die. He's pretty tough, by the way, but you're gonna murder him with that weapon. But he's like surprising stuff. Like Pib, um, Pib screwed up his first game, but like ever Dark Souls game by attacking that guy because he couldn't kill him, and then he just basically because he just started the game, he just got spawn camped at Firelink Shrine by that guy because he doesn't diagro. <laughs> he's actually yeah, he almost fucking killed me. Mm -hmm, he's not. Just try fighting Loudrek. Like try fighting Loudrek legitly. That guy can kill you if you're not careful. Not too shabby, he says. I think you've done me a favor. That was a pretty cool speech. I'm glad I killed him. He go he goes hollow anyway. If you speak to him at a certain point, he wanders off and um goes hollow in New London. Whatever. Now he's dead. And he doesn't drop anything different. Like what he dropped now, like number of souls, any items he dropped. I can't remember if he does. Like that stuff's exactly the same, no matter where he is. Like if you kill him then, no, or if you wait till he goes hollow. It's just a thousand souls. Mm -hmm. A thousand souls is all I earned. It's hoping you're worth more because you're actually stronger than most of the shit I ever yeah, seem to fight. Good. One. One. NPCs tend to be pretty tough because you're not supposed to attack them in theory, you know? Well, yeah, you know, but whatever. Fuck that guy. Well, that's why I said in theory. Right, let's go up to nine of these. Reinforced weapon. Uh, motorcycle. Take a leak. Sure. Fine weapon. Uh, purchase items.
Okay, what do I want to do next? Just trying to think. So oh, I know what I want to do. It was snowing at uh oh. I might have to take out. I've got no food left. There's literally nothing in my house to cook with. I'm gonna go back to the asylum and do the uh, stray demon, I think. I want a takeout. Oh well. Such a shame ordering takeout. Uh, how dare you? I know, right? I'm gonna. I'm uh, heading off to do the stray demon. I'm gonna go do snug. Uh, go down to Thingy Jake and also do snugly the crow thing because if I remember rightly, I can't remember the list of shit. But I know I've got rubbish and that helps. Uh yeah. This I here. hear your snores, motherfucker. No oh, fuck. Damn it. I'm gonna try, like, I'm gonna, um... I'm gonna send the footage to YouTube and see what it looks like. Well, I'm gonna send it private. Um, like, of the chase, I mean. And then, if it looks okay, I'm gonna download it and, like, actually properly edit it into something cool. If it, if it like, doesn't look like it'll be good enough to, like, be able to download it and, you know, reprocess it and stuff, I'll just leave it as it is. But I kinda wanna put, like, yeah. dumb music and stuff on it as well, because it'd be funny. You could use the go the goose song from um, Zelda, the new one. Oh, you know that, guy, that big guy goose, and he's got the fucking dirty ass tune when he walks around. Well, I was right there, like, I, well, like I already know, like, if I, can, if, I can, if, I can, if I can, if I can, if I can edit it, I know one thing I'll be doing, and that's like when that bit when I decide to run for the fo for the thing, it would be like on the screen, it'd be like, all right, let's go, and then just like fucking anime music just starts playing as I sprint. <laughs> that's pretty ridiculous. I'm a big fan of this concept. That's of course if it's good enough to edit. It might not be good enough to edit. I don't know what it'll look like, so we'll have to see. Up we go, and then onto the ledge. Yeah, that, uh, that fucking ledge jump is so oh. much easier to just do with an evasive roll. God damn it. I keep fucking it up. Nope, I'm a legit boss. Like, if just I stand on the very edge of that ledge and I just fucking tap evade and I roll straight dead onto it. Yeah, I'm bad. I'm just bad at doing the jump. Alright, the Undead Asylum key. Yeah, uh, Colby thought I meant, um, I tweeted about, like, what just happened. Colby thought I meant Valley of Defilement from Demon Souls rather than Blighttown. 
And I was just like, man, yeah. I was just thinking, man, if that happened in Valley of Defilement, I would just kill myself. Valley of Defilement is so that much been a fuck this shit moment. Valley of Defilement is so much worse than Blight Town. Just imagine they're pretty much exactly the same, like they follow the same kind of thing, but just, but Valley of Defilement's worse. Like way worse. Curl up like a ball. Yeah. I have a plus six. See on your screen, it's X to stand up. On mine, it's A to stand up. Now to keep on waiting. Oh, are you Curl doing the like same? Are you doing the same thing as me? Yeah, I'm like literally, I'm equal with you right now. I'm just fucking waiting for this bird. Come on! Yeah, he's got picked up. <sighs> Any fucking second. There we go. Now I am. Hey, it takes longer for your cutscene to load up. Yeah, cause I'm now ahead of you again. Well, yeah, because PlayStation. You gotta remember that. Yeah. I forgot about that thing, kind of thing happening there. Like, oh, you should, I'm man. You should, you, you should. I, I don't know if you. I love the zoom in on your character. I don't know if you've if you've watched <laughs> my Demon Souls stuff, but like the loading screens in Demon Souls are brutal. They're really long. Are they just so long? Yeah, like if you just go and look at any of my Demon Souls stuff, you'll see. Yeah, no, I'm planning to hot watch just a shit ton of that, and very soon, in fact. Oh god, now they have torches! Torches! Torches on my skin! <laughs> These burns, they will <laughs> not heal! Oh god. Remember, don't run. If you, unless you want to do the straight demon right the fuck now, don't run out into the middle of this room. Yeah, I remember. I might try the straight demon, I don't know. I'd recommend doing it, but I'd recommend using the bonfire here first. Well, yeah, yeah. I almost died. Keep what? me warm. Also, I'm gonna kill the, um... I'm going to kill the okay. Black Knights and I... stuff first. Right, I'm gonna do Snuggly the Crow's thing. So I just open it up, and then I drop him down on him, and then I quit, right? And yeah, re-enter. That is correct. Sweet. So, uh, I wonder if sunlight metals do it. No, I forgot to open this shortcut. Oh, Son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, I always do the fucking same thing. Ah, uh, well. I want the crest shield before I do the stray Rubbish. demon, because that's better magic da uh, resistance. Sure. Thank you, Corby. We we appreciate your points for giving you gave us for the Lincoln Park song. We're amazing. I know. Also, Kobe, like, you sh so should have been watching before, like, Ronith and Dan can tell you how nuts and intense it was when I was invaded. It was straight up pants on head. <laughs> like, he tried for ages to use that fucking rapper god thing to knock you off. Everybody fighting this guy oh, in this area is fucking a dumb idea. Uh, I might die. I very easily could die in this. He should have used up all your endurance in one swing. I need to get past him, that's the problem. Like, the best place to fight him is, is the area behind him. Yeah, and getting past him is a bit of a fucking chore. There we go, got him to move to one side. It's why I want I, I, I'm annoyed I forgot to open that shortcut, because if you open that shortcut, you can get behind- you can come from this direction, so it's just a lot easier to draw him into this area. You can come from behind! Right, I'm gonna before I hop back in and see what Snuggly the Crow has dropped. Oh in, shit! That was dumb. Damn food. That was really dumb. So, what did you do? Get hit. Oh right, that. Yeah. Boop. Basically, Kobe, what happened was um, at the start of Blight Town, like literally right at the start of Blight Town, I got invaded, and said invader. Oh shit, I'm alive. How am I alive? Guys? I don't know. My health. Yeah, I'll keep explaining for you. Basically, this invader was a complete cheeser. He was a ridiculous cheeser. He was trying to do all the dumb tactics like dragon arrows to knock him off and a uh, wrath of god to bounce him off of ledges and he was waiting all the dumb spots and trying to get him to walk into poison darts and shit like that and, and none just, of this stuff worked. And Not basically just, sto thing. just stalking me through the whole uh, Hold the same yeah, he st it started near the top. He was just going towards the Iato that drops in there. 
No, no, it was like right at the start. It, it was literally the. It was literally. Oh yeah, right it was at the start. start. Yeah, so you made it. Then you're like, I could leave, but actually, I'm kind of entertained, and so you kept on going, and then you made it to fucking Quaylag. You made it this whole goddamn journey with this guy stalking and trying to kill you at all the worst killing troll points, but you still got away in the end, and then you got to Quaylag and then quit out afterwards because he got forced to leave. And that guy, he was lucky using fucking talismans to stop using Estos flasks. I mean, little did he know he'd actually drank all of them already and you wanted humanities, but you know, it was fucking dumb. <clears throat> Fuck well, you. nearly killed him once, he just ran away like a pussy. It's, no, I nearly killed him twice. Well, actually, no, okay, first first time I legit almost killed him. Like, that was 100% I won that fight. Second time, um, second time we both got really badly injured and both backed the hell out. So like in the entire thing, in the in the entire like descent, there was only actual two proper confrontational fights. The rest was him stalking and trying to ki and just trying to like knock me off ledges and stuff like that and throw fire bombs at me and shit. So I just had him stalking me the entire game. I will be uploading the entire thing to YouTube. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how yet. It'll either be um, if I can. If it's in good enough quality for me to be able to edit it, I will be editing it to make it even more amusing with like funny music and shit. Uh, if not, I'll just upload the whole thing in just one go. Either way, it'll be on YouTube. And it's gonna be great. Boop! Okay, I'm gonna order some Chinese food, so I'm just gonna eat on that quickly. Sure. Mm -hmm. Sure, what's your suggestion, Colby? Yeah, there's the 80 magic to resist. That's the shield I want. 80 magic uh, defense. That's what I need. Scheming weasel. Okay, I will look it up. The only thing I was thinking of right, at the, basically right at the end, the way I got away was like he backed out, and I realized I could just make. I was just like, fuck it, I'm making a sprint for the. Um, I'm making a sprint for the exit. So basically what I want to do if I can edit it at that point, it'll be just like out on the screen, it'll just like words will just be like, fuck it, let's go, and I'll just start sprinting, and then I'm just gonna put on like the cheesiest battle anime music I can as I'm sprinting for the exit. <laughs> this guy's this corridor's like not too bad to fight in. The other corridor's a lot tighter. Yeah, this this guy's a lot easier to kill. Let's give him get a parry. The answer to that is no. Boop. Titanite chunk. Really, neither of them dropped their swords. I have seven humanity. How the hell did neither of them drop their swords? Kill the adult. Like, I, I don't understand. Like that. That's pretty damn unlikely. You max the knights. The black. The black knights. They are servants of Lord Gwyn, who was Scott. Who were um. They, they, they used to be the Silver Knights of Anno Londo. Uh, the Silver Knights of Anno Londo basically guard the gods and goddesses in Anno Londo. But the Black Knights are ones that were scorched. Their, their armor has been scorched black by the flame, the first flame, by the, in the kiln with the first flame. And so they wander the land, like, killing people. It's basically the, the, the quick way of saying what they are. In the original concept for Dark Souls, they were going to they, the Dark Soul, the Dark Knight, the sorry, the Black Knight, a spawns weren't going to be set. They were going to be um, instead Black Knights were going to roam the world, so you could just randomly encounter roaming Black Knights at any point in the game, which would be a lot more terrifying and kind of awesome. Okay, I got Fire Estus flasks. Let's do this. The roll. Oh shit. I'm 
So this is the stray demon. It's not particularly difficult. Really, it's more it's all about dodging. And the magic attacks he keeps doing, the red smoke, that's really powerful. If you get caught in that, you can die very quickly. It's all about watching him to see which attacks he's going to do. Ideally, this is the best attack you want him to do because it's very easy to avoid. If he does anything like that, like raising his thing to slam it into the ground, that, that means he's going to do a magic attack. This one is his nastiest. He just have a very quick sweep and a magic explosion appears in front of him. Very, very nasty. Very hard to avoid if, because it's so fast. But I should heal because I think I might. Not entirely sure how good my magic resistance is. Oh, that was close. See, like, look how fast that attack comes out. There we go, there's the bleed. So, Stray Demon and Asylum Demon and uh, Demon Fire Sage, they are all the same type of demon. They're all these guys. Um, they are weak to bleed attacks, which means that uh, weapons like, th like, oh god, hang on, <laughs> dodging that. They're weapons like the Aeto, which is what I'm using, which cause bleed, very good on them. bleed guff on this guy. Yep, there's a bleed. You notice how much damage that suddenly did? That was the bleed effect going off. That's the stray demon dead. Honestly, not too much of a big deal. The, the, usually, like, usually that fight is decided by the very start because you take so much damage from falling into the arena. That like, and if you get caught in an awkward position when you fall, you can die very quickly. Majority, majority of people like struggle on that fight because of the start. But once you've actually gotten, once you survived the start and gotten close to him and can see what he's doing, it's a lot easier. And now we're back down here. Alright, so next thing on the agenda is to go back down into Blight Town. Oh, I didn't get the rest of Dying Ring. I should do that. Yeah, I need to go get the rest of Dying Ring. That's in this area. It's this way, in fact. Next thing to do, yeah, go to Blight Town, uh, kill Quelag, and also farm some. Uh, I want to farm some uh, large Titanite shards from the leeches down there. Wait, I'm going the wrong way. I'm not thinking. Hey, I'm back. Hey, Dan. Uh, no, I can't teleport to Blight Town. I was going to order Chinese, but I lost my, I've lost my fucking money. You've lost your well, money? I thought I lost money. I actually must have... I, I had, like, a couple notes just hanging around, and I realized I must have spent them. Oh, that's really sucks. frustrating, so I was going to use those for takeaway. So instead, I'm going to have to order Domino's online. Ah, oh, how sad for you. <sighs> Woe is me. Like, I don't know why my life is the sum of all the hardships in the world, but... While you were gone, in, it, in the time you were gone, I killed the stray demon and the other black knight. Oh, I'm sad that I missed it. Especially since I'd probably need all the tips for killing stray demon as I, I can get, because I fucked that one up. Uh, I, I can give you the tips again while you're doing it. It's pretty simple. Uh, the, the biggest one is that the majority of the fight is decided by the first, like, five seconds of it. Five, ten seconds. Because you take a ton of damage from falling. And also, you can't. You're not entirely sure wh when you fall. You're not entirely sure where he is in comparison to you. Like you need to get as soon as you get into that fight, you need to get the fuck behind him. <laughs> and you also like you need to roll when you land, so you take less damage. Uh, as, anyway, to go back to Colby's question, I can't teleport to Blight Town because to teleport you need to use the Lord Vessel, which you don't get until you've defeated 
until you've rung both Bells of Awakening and done Sense Fortress and Anna Londo. I would also recommend. I can add nine toppings to this pizza for free. <laughs> Holy shit! Nice. Also, Dan, you you want to um. Uh, what do you want to do? Yeah, you want to get the crest shield from um, the knight guy that you can kill in the asylum because it has eighty percent net magic that block, and that's just that the, a lot of the big damaging attacks from the stray demon are magical. Is um, that or like upgrade a crack shield like fucking crazy? Just easier to get the, the thingy shield because he's already in the um, he's already in the the asylum. Uh, for those who are wondering what I'm doing right now, I'm looking up the trading list for Snuggly the Crow because I want to know if there's anything I need right now. Uh, I could give him a, I could get a Titanite chunk off him. Can I get large Titanite? Large Titanite would be really useful. No, just Titanite chunks. Oh, can you link me that list for the the stuff that he drops? Because I I'm actually st like stood at that nest right now where I've quit out. There you go. It's in for, it's in the fabulosity chat. <clears throat> Much obliged. Uh, the only one that I want to do then would be to drop rubbish. Which I have somewhere. Listen to this, I got green pepper, smoked bacon, tandoori chicken, herbs, onion, sweet corn tuna, uh, pepperoni. Ah, oh, that would be too many. Oh, you can get a ton of twinkling titanite from him, I totally forgot. You can get like four twinkling titanite from him. Tight neck chunk. <clears throat> I don't need twinkling titanite, but you definitely do, Dan. So you can you can get four twinkling titanite off snugly. I'm just going to heal and then jump off. <laughs> Alright, now we're going back to Blight Town. <clears throat> but because uh, I'm not going back in the normal way. Screw that. Oh, I cannot. I can. I guess I should do this. Reinforce this flask. Yes. Since I've been carrying around that firekeeper soul for so long now. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going into Blight Town through the rear entrance because I don't really want to go in through the front entrance again. It takes too, way too long. This is way quicker.
I mean, I get, there's a couple of things in Blighttown I kind of maybe want to get, like the ninja costume, but it's really not worth going through Blighttown again to get it, especially with the FPS drops. Why do I suck, Pete? That's just mean and uncalled for. You're a very rude person. I, I, I want to go and get the, the Undead Dragon's loot for no particular reason. They're only defenseless because they have no mines left. Okay, so this guy will not come to life unless you hit him or steal walk in a particular space. You can take this loot completely fine. He will not attack you. In here, you can take one of you can get one of those things without it, um, without him aggroing. Let's see if I can do it. You have to inch very slowly. You can get at this piece of loot, if I remember correctly. Yeah. You get the straight sword. That there is the Dragon Crest Shield. If you want that, you have to wake him up. He will wake up if you grab this. Do I want to get it? Fuck it. Yeah, I do. That was simple enough. He can't do anything. He has no lower body. <laughs> he has no body to go with. Oh, shit. <laughs> Hey Roneth, when are you coming back to join us and playing Dark Souls? Alright, my pizza is now tracked and on its way back to the Dark Souls adventure. I'm back in Blight Town. Nice. Yeah, the level thirty one. Yeah, me and Dan, Dan and me are playing. Obviously separate games, but yeah. We we were both playing while on the event together. Uh Ronith was also playing earlier, but he had to leave because he's lame. And by lame I mean his internet was shitting the bed. It's gonna take fucking ages. Quit game, quit game. Are you trading more stuff? Yeah. Hup, hup, hup. Ow. Stab. It just rapes everything. That's a shame, Corby. <laughs> yes, I'm playing, I'm playing a Nintendo DS at the same time, Pete. <laughs> I've actually hotwired my PS3 so it uses a DS as a controller. It's a thing that's happened. <laughs> uh, back in uh, Blade Town, back in the home of FPS drops. At least it isn't actually throttling your machine that you're doing the streaming yeah, on. Yeah, exactly. It's that's just throttling. That's why I'm glad. That that's the yes. honestly recording and stuff is the main reason I bought Dark Souls the second time. So I, on the PS3, so obviously I have it on PC, and then I bought just bought it again for PlayStation. And recording was the main reason behind that. Be 
because this way I can just use different things for God. Like, for example, oh shit, I fell off. God damn it. I just fall off into the. Into Blight Town, I fell down. Oh, off the ledge. Yeah. Oh sh shit, that was quite the death. I thought it was fine. I seemed to be fine. I'm doing and then just... Like, I've got his list open, so. Twinkling Titanite, yeah, give me more. More, 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 more. Drop that blooming purples. But I mean, like, it's pretty simple. It's pretty, um. No, what am I trying to say? It's pretty great. Like, playing on the PlayStation means that, like, obviously, all the game process, progress and stuff, and all, the, all that power is the PS3's handling all that. And then the actual screen capturing is all being handled by the, um. by my capture card. And then my computer is handling all the streaming. So if I have three different machines all yep. doing each their own individual bit. Mm, that's a lot of twinkling tight night. I'm happy about that. Oh, hell yeah, Pete. That's going to be awesome. What's up? Pete's making another... He made like a, a joke um, uh, advert for uh, PFC. Pete fried chicken. And he's making another one for his channel, a trailer. Fair enough, Carby. Have fun. Peace. I hope you enjoy the, uh, the video when it goes up of my daring escape. I should have bought a dung pie, god damn. What? I will try to remember the song. Well, I try to remember it and also hope it fits. It might not fit. Alright, it's not for the trailer. Uh, that's pretty cool. Either way, it should be pretty good. I I'll definitely watch it. Like, that kind of stuff's fun to watch. Oh. Now, rare ring of sacrifice, that's that. Let's see, if I got prism stone or dung pie? I have not. I've got a pyromancy flame, but I'm kind of using it right now. You can only give him plus zero. Oh, you, you have plus zero, yeah, I forgot. You rescued uh, uh oh, 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 I clicked back onto my screen, which means that I swung my sword and the swing almost knocked me off the ledge. Like I almost want to take a screenshot of the fact that I'm floating on fucking nothing. No, I'd get I'd get off the ledge before you kill yourself. <sighs> I'm off the ledge. It's so dick that they put Snuggly in that position. Yeah, alright, that's all the stuff I need off of him. 